Hello everyone, Ren here. So like I promise, I'll play Alien Isolations back to back with Alien Fireteam. Just to make it, you know, fair enough. I know there's just been many playthroughs of this, but you know what, this is Alien, I gotta, I gotta play it, I gotta play it, you know, come on. So that, this is also got some add-ons to it, some kind of uh, DLC of The Last Survivor, and I can't remember what the other one was, but I bought those. So I can just uh, see what they are. But you know what? What's this? Play Last Survivor downloadable content. Survivor mode challenges. Is this new? Well, since we're here, we'll just play the main campaign. Once head tracking enables allows the PlayStation camera can do system to track your head movements, applying them to your characters when in peak mode. Use for big. I don't have that. Well, I don't have it with me right now. So no. Well, that's a new one. <clears throat> Track the noise level of your room whilst you play. If you make any loud noise, the enemies might hear you. Holy crap! If I would, if I would have kept it. This is this is looks interesting. But uh, for now, let's just play the game normally. Just for the fun of it, let's go to hard mode. I know it's gonna be stupid of me, but. Crouching while it's moving is quieter, but will slow you down. Vents are a great way of avoiding danger, but they may not always be as safe as you think. Oh no, shit. Sorry. But that would be interesting to play with the camera. Final report of the commercial starship Nostromo. Third officer reporting. The other members of the crew. Kane, Lambert, Parker, Brett, Ash, and Captain Dallas are dead. Cargo and ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. Okie dokie. It's always good to hear a voice. It's always good. Ripley? I'm Samuels. I work for the company. It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. commercial vessel, the Anisadora, has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a, a permanent freeport. I facility. know what it is. Transit's arranged. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We? Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Look, Ripley. 
When this job came across my desk, I read the case history. I know why you're working in the region where she went missing. You're still looking, aren't you? I've been cleared to offer you a place on the Torrance if you want to come along. Maybe there'll be some closure for you. Okay, I'm able to move. I see my feet. Is there a jump button? Uh, walking around. <laughs> Gonna do some squats. Door locked. Sign in. Okay. What the hell is that? What am I doing? I don't know. <clears throat> She's a pretty tall woman. Unless it's just, just how short it is the hallways and stuff. What do we got here? Personnel. Brilliant, you on the lookout for an... What the? Oh. Got a notification there, sorry. I like a trophy earned. Uh, you on the lookout for a, a navigational officer. I have a, a friend that's just lost his ship and he's looking for work. I can vouch for him. He's got good papers. Same old story, the mega cards undercut him, picked up all his clients. Contracts are getting harder to come by for the smaller companies. And I'm thinking I'm getting out myself while I still have something to sell. Sounds like you're dr doing good. okay though. Dropped by the docks and heard you just shipped out. Sevastopol? Station, what a shithole. Still, I hear Waylon Yutani pay well. Good luck to you if you can't beat them, right? Let's catch up. When you get back, Blaine. Interesting. Cigarettes. Coffee. Do 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 do. do. Hmm. <whistles> you see this often, more often in the ships. Ha ha ha. Anyways, Dreamcatcher. It's a very in is. Well, let's, I don't know. That's an interesting thing for a dream catcher. <clears throat> Alright, so. I did a good job, guys. I saved the game. <laughs> Please wait. Start program. Relains one signed in. Connor, crew ID two zero zero three WI signed in. I uh, no idea what this works. Torrens. Oh yeah, I gotta get dressed in order to go where I need to go. Don't want to just walked out there half naked and go, hey guys. Oh, whoops. Oh. Here, I'll take a shower with my clothes on. Just to make it funny. There we go. Nice and wet.
It says please wait. That doesn't make any sense. Did I glitch the game already? <clears throat> I just started. Come on now. I have no idea what that is about. Do do do. Something here? No? Or maybe? What's in here first? Oh, here we are. Taylor, good morning. Ripley, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Waylon Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. I realize your mother has been missing for 15 years and, and you... It's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? Uh, have you seen Samuels? He's probably been up for hours. I'll catch up with him. So you just gotta take what you can, right? Okay, here we go. To N. Taylor. Nostromo incident, Wailing Utani file. Hey Taylor, I got your case request. It may take me a while to dig out the files, and the incident happened before my time at the company. So I'm a bit fuzzy on the details. In uh, 2122, the Wailing Utani cargo vessel, the USCSS Nostromo, went missing. No trace was found of its cargo or crew. Apart from a new science officer, the rest of the crew had worked together before. Seven in all. Got the uh, Kane, or is it Kane? Executive officer. <laughs> Warrant officer, navigation officer. It's all the guys we know from the first movie. Uh, Whitley and Otani lost a, a lot of money from it. It's a bit of a black mark in the history. Get the impression they don't like to mention it anyway. I'll try and find the files later. Clarify some of the uh, points if you want. I can help you go through them. Maybe some of your luck will rub off on me. I hear upstairs have an eye on you for something big. Sol. What's this? M class starship. Berlin Diane. Navigation com officer. Connor Williams. Owner. Outbound and return transportation for Whaling Yutani. Retrieval. Team to West Sebastopol Station. Team consists of three W to Y employees. Samuel C. Ripley, A. Taylor M. Passengers, Samuels, Christopher Ripley, Amanda, Taylor, Nina. Numbers of decks, two. Numbers of crew, two. Interstellar communication antenna, long haul hypersleep chamber, commercial passenger, cargo ship. Retrofitted from a tow rig, retains operational heavy duty tow umbilical. Okay. That's good stuff to know. All right, let's uh, go on, mostly on to the next. Or, not there. Kitchen. There's not gonna be anything in here for me. Is this it? Or is it? No, I've been through there. I think I might as well go back. Wonder if there's anything here. Ooh. Oops. I guess not. Oh well. I fucked up the first time. Let's see. Anything. Good jump scare, but it didn't jump scare me. Nice way to block this. Nobody can go up there. A lot of valves, though, too. There's Sammy. Oh, Ripley. Samuels, did you wake up early? 
Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of you. I was just inspecting the Torrens facilities, a well-maintained ship. I realize it's a very uh -huh. similar model to... The Nostromo. Yes, M-Class. A later pattern of close inspection. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor there? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. We talked. She seems nervous. Hmm. I hadn't noticed. She's a skilled executive, though. Should help us with any legal issues we might encounter. Goody, goody, goody. Don't need any problems, do we? No, we don't. Looks like we're up. That's if I can find the bridge. Man, it's like a fucking maze here. Is it this way? Oh, I should have followed you. Follow the robot. You can always tell that he's a robot. Or an android. There we go. Forgot about that. Hope you all had a restful journey. The Torrens is in very good order for an old M-Class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how we doing? Awesome. G loaded and calibrated. Approach vector locked. Prep comm so I can say hello. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? You can watch the approach on the monitors. Which monitors? These ones? No. No. Come on. Is it us? No. Oh, these are... Okay. Trophy urn. I'm awake. Can we see it? Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74. Tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is a commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sevastopol Traffic Control. We're carrying three passengers on a Wayland. Yutani Bond, you're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers port side over. <laughs> Marshall? Mar Marshall, this is the Torrent. Say again. The station's comm seemed pretty screwed up, so I fitted Samuel's suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. It's the only option. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. Oh, stop complaining and just do your job. Wine, wine, wine. Just shout on me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Affirmative.
Hiding is only ever a temporary solution. <laughs> it's a good thing we didn't have to do anything with that, that cutscene there, because I probably would have failed a lot of attempts right there. Like, all right, try to make it to the to the hatch. Oh, you failed. Faster than you should be, but okay. Um, uh, that's not that way. Is it this? Aha! Okay, I can run. Cool, cool. Why could I have that one? It's white. This one was yucky yellow. We're gonna look look around everywhere too, because you never know what you're gonna find. You're gonna need what you need. Because remember, I don't have a gun. That gun have been a little bit easier. Oh. Anything over here? Nothing. 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 See nothing there. Okay. Woo wee! I think this looks like it's a good spot. Um Is there anything in nope, there's nothing over there. Okay. As long as we get out of the way of that fire, we're good. Yeah. Oh boy. Run. My first was in here. Folder corrupted. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Decommission. So boys and girls, you've probably heard the whisper about Sevastopol by now, and I can confirm it's official. Sevastopol is being decommissioned. I will go over with each of you what this means in regards to your con contracts and next placement. But for now, we still have a job to do. The suits want this done with a skeleton crew. Hmm. Which means we'll only be getting a few outside contractors to help. But it does mean over time, I am recommend taking what you can while it's available. I should point out that the de decommission does not mean lucky dip. Everything here has to be accounted for. And I will personally escort anyone found helping themselves to equipment to Marshall Waits, Chief.
Huh, these are corrupted. I think there's a way you can actually see those, but I don't know how. Let's collect that. Something else here. No. Hmm. Oh, goody. This is why I say, oh, goody. That's gotta hurt. God damn. God damn, it is, you're right. Not wasting it. Mm -mm. Can I hit people with it? Something new. Someone new. What the hell? Someone new you always know working, Joe. Forgotten. Strangers will be. What? Shot. Okay. Need moving. Deep moving or. Something like that. Anything else? I can't put it away. Turn it off. We don't want anything to come in after us, just in case. Passcode required. God damn it. Okay. Unless there's a passcode here somewhere. Is this thing usable? No, it's not. Uh, I don't see anything else. There's a bag. Of course, there's nothing in the bag. You know, with all this stuff here, you never know what could be useful. It says, forgotten. Forgotten, forgotten. This life for rent? Doesn't anything here work? Well, that's obvious right there. Nothing works. But hey, let's see. Okay, let's see. Hey, it works now. Doesn't look like it's enough power. Usually it'd be green, right? Save game just in case. That did not sound right. Did you guys hear that right? It sounded like there was a xenomorph nearby. Okay. Langley, if you're looking for our stash, I've moved it. You left it right out in the open where anyone could have taken it. Jesus, do you know what I had to do to get it? I've hidden it in one of the... The storerooms. You should be able to find it. The code is 0340. Don't worry, no one goes down to the terminal anymore. Not after it'll happen. Also, we're out of the meds and low on water, so you're going to need to get some. It's your turn. Maybe it'll teach you to take care of our stuff in future. Oh, what? I forgot the fucking cold again. Sorry about that. Okay, it's 0340. 0340. We've had a long journey together, but sadly it's coming to an end. Siegs and Corp would like to take this opportunity to thank all of you who worked and lived at Sevastopol over the years and hope that Siegs and has helped to make it a productive and rewarding environment. <laughs> Look around you. Certainly didn't do a good job. Our investment and belief in the station has never wavered. Be sure that Siegs and Apollo's Android AI and working Android Androids will be there to serve 
So best stop until the last rivet is removed. We wish you all the way, all the very best for the future. After all, so is Topo isn't just a station, it's people. So, hold on, listen, what makes it? Harris, Turner, get back here now. We have a track. Summer and engineer. Lock the terminal down, kill the power, and don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're going to need our paperwork to be bulletproof when this shit is over. Wait's out. Restore power to departures. So. Zero three four zero zero three four zero zero three four zero. It's funny I'm running around with a fucking flare. Okay, yeah. Uh, zero. Three. Four. Zero. Sweet munchkies. Collect. So what you lose? What do we got? Come on. Anything? Ooh, you found a bl blueprint to access the crap thing. All for medkits? Interesting, interesting, interesting. I'm building to survive, but there was nothing really. Well, there were some things that were useful, but nothing that was really help. Right in the beginning of the game, but there's nothing new. Let's see. Restore power. What is it? Ah, oh, it's just a model. Restore power. Okay, there's gotta be something here. Anything it could, uh, huh? Great, do I gotta go back or something? There's no way. There's got to be something here. Anything to do with this? No. There has to be something. There has to be. I'm already goddamn lost in the beginning of the game, of course. Of course I'm going to be lost in the goddamn beginning of the game. something here that can probably help out. Maybe I missed something. I don't know. Okay. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, duh. Okay. Let's not go there yet. figured it out. Good thing. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. <coughs> yeah, okay, I'm an idiot. I should have just dodged. Apollo. Tomorrow, no to get tomorrow equals no future, no together future, whatever. What the hell happened here? 
Rest in peace, Sebastopol. Basically, there was a mutiny. Did you not read the report? Oh, wait, I had to read the report. You probably just, like, didn't exactly pay attention. What do we got here? Strangers will be shot. You can't go. It's 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 not like back on Earth or you know where you wave at the helicopter. Hi, God. hi. Damn it. it doesn't work like that. Well, yeah, but good try though. to start making xenomorph noises right off the bat. You don't just go and put that on a spotlight with your crew. You, you think it, you know your crew well. Especially with a big ship like this, you really don't. Everybody has different opinions on things and different ways that they see their job. Okay, here we go. Zoe, I'm sorry, but I won't need you to come in next week. As you know, the store's been in trouble for some time now, and I couldn't hold off the creditors any longer. There's just no one coming to Sevastopol anymore. It's not just us either. It sounds like the whole station is in the red, and they're pulling the plug, going to sell it off or scrap. I guess I was speaking to one of the engineers, and he reckons they'll announce it soon. I'm telling you this so you don't stick around looking for another job. Sevastopol's finished. Time to move on. Harper. Whoops. Usually, I'm trying to get the. Uh... What is Apollo? To all spaceflight personnel, spaceflight terminal employees, and the interest of public safety and the prevention of panic, it must be made clear to all potential passengers that there are currently no scheduled flights leaving Sevastopol, nor ships available. The, the Colonial Marshals are investigating problems on station and will update accordingly from the office of Marshal Waits. What is Apollo? Apollo is the central AI that monitors and provides guidance for all the Siegsun, Siegsun? working Joes on Sevastopol. Apollo also oversees all communications on the station, so wherever you are, you know you're in safe hands. Siegsun, tomorrow, together. Certainly didn't do anything good with the together part. And there certainly is no tomorrow. Hmm. Well... Sadly, we're gonna have to save and we're running out of time. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoyed 
stupidity a little bit there for being lost, but at least you figured it out. But anyways, if you liked, if you like to see more of this and you want to keep watching all my videos and stuff, like and subscribe. Until the next video, guys. Run out.